All right, welcome back. Fabulous Football Friday, week one, sponsored by Beckley ARH and Window World of Beckley. A beautiful week one it was. Oak Hill, the surprise team last year, right? No expectations, and then out of nowhere, they came on, and they turned it on. And they got all the way to the playoffs. Incredible job by Oak Hill. But the thing is, now you have expectations. So when you have expectations, things change. But Devon Marion knows that, and he's been preaching to his team that. So they start things off at Nicholas County. Let's go out. See how it goes. We go out to Summersville for a major game between two US 19 rivals, Nicholas County taking on the Oak Hill Red Devils who are looking to build on a very successful season last year. Nicholas County came out throwing the ball and got some success inside the hashes. But Oak Hill was able to stiffen up that next defense. Look at this here, and this is what Oak Hill did all last season. Big time defensive plays, and there's the interception. All last season they did this, and they did it again. Big time interception. That's the battle on the play that the Red Devil defense rallies. And then Oak Hill driving the ball down the field as quarterback Richardson fakes the handoff to Jeremiah Moritz, and move on, move on. Gets to Anton Hicks. Beautiful play, and there's the touchdown. And look at this play here. It faked out everybody, but the K, including the camera guy. And Oak Hill takes the early lead for the next drive. Nicholas County goes to three and out, and Oak Hill's special team unit gets the punter's block. And that's how it rolls. Then Matthias Stack covering the ball in the end zone, and they're up leading early. Back-to-back -back offensive, then it's the run game. Moritz, how often did we see this last year? And look at him go this year. A menace bulldozing over everybody once again. He gets the ball and bursts through some tackles for another big gain. Nicholas County back on offense now. And just as they finally got their offense going, Oak Hill secondary comes up big. Armani Hicks undercuts the receiver and gets the pick. The Oak Hill short game was hitting too. Antoine Hicks gets the ball and bursts, cutting all the way across the field for the big game. Hicks and Hicks doing their job tonight for the Oak Hill Red Devils. And then just after the start, of the first half, Nicholas County finally gets something on offense. Devin Hash carries the ball deep into the red zone. The quarterback gets them closer and closer, and then he gets it done. Colton Helms gets into the end zone, but Oak Hill goes on to win their opener 25, 28 to 15. From there, we go to Route 19 to Midland Trail, where the Patriots welcomed in Clay County for their season opener with the late kickoff tonight. And Midland Trail excited to get things underway on their brand new field. But out of the gate, it was a defensive slugfest for both teams. And you get that week one quarterback, Noel Collins for Clay County, searching for the sticks on third down on Clay's first possession taking a big hit out of bounds clay punts midland trail with the ball and they showed some signs of life as thad brown puts up a jump ball for ian harper and he makes a big strong catch between two defenders but wait a minute he comes down just short of the sticks so out comes the chain gang and trail comes up short by the slimmest of margins look at that literally the referees billfold wow so Trail, keep the offense on the field for fourth and short for a power run, and Clay's front seven says no way, no way. Turnover on downs, but Clay's joy is short-lived on the first play of the next possession. They snap the ball over the quarterback's head for a major loss. Collins is able to make up for it with a big chunk of that here with the quarterback keeper there, but is it enough? It's not enough. Ian Harper for trail playing great defense and breaking up the potential first down pass. And he celebrates with his brother's secondary. Then Midland Trail finally finding some joy there. Big time stop there by Ian Harper as you see it. Secondary going crazy. Defensive battle all the way through. Now Midland Trail Getting stuff going on offense was the key as Harper makes a great play on the other side of the ball and comes down with the jump pass. Harper all over the field despite taking a wallop there from the safety. But now it's fourth down. The offense stays on the field and they go back to what's working. And this time 
It's Aiden Foster going up and coming down with the ball on the far sideline. What a catch. Now it's time for the ground and pound as Will McGraw gets inside the 10-yard line. But the clay defense holds up thanks to Joel Elliott first. He lays the boom and forces the fumble on third down. Midland recovers, but they come up short on fourth as Elliott again gets physical and breaks up the pass. The defense was lights out, but Clay can't do anything with the turnover, and they punt it away. That's the first quarter. Second quarter now, trail with the ball. Thad Brown puts up a pass that's picked off by Noah Collins. He reads his eyes the whole way, undercuts it, and takes it to the house. Clay counting, coming out on top 28-7. to seven. From there, we go out to the rivalry between the two Virginias, and it's a defensive battle like no other. 3-0 Graham in the fourth quarter. Bluefield trying to get something going as Simpson takes the snap, has time, looks around downfield, but Amari Bailey comes off the edge for the sack lunch, and he dances to let him know, I'm here to play. Bailey with the big time defensive play has to Bluefield has to punt it away. Low snap here. Harris gets it, bobbles it though. Harris just gets it away in time. And look at the hop catch here by Fix who goes near sideline. Fix gets out of bounds, gets a good gain for Graham. And now Graham's on offense and Roberts in shotgun. One to his right, Robert gets the snap, steps up. Complete to Elon. Elon turns. Elon sees room and he takes off. Goodbye, goodbye. Malachi Elon scores the first touchdown of the game. And Graham now leads 10 to 0 in the fourth. Bluefield has to get something going. Last chance here. Simpson, the freshman, claps, finds Smith. Smith dances, breaks the tackle, gets a couple yards. Third and two. Got to get the first. Simpson. Gives it to the big man Patton, but Patton gets locked up immediately. Now it's fourth down with the game on the line. Simpson under center has to get a yard, but he can't do it. Bluefield can't get the first. Graham wins 10 to 0. From there, we wrap it up with the scores. Woodrow Wilson with a big week one win, 17 to 10 over Washington. Greenbrier East, 24-20 Riverside. Herbert Hoover, 37-30 Independence. We saw that last night. Princeton, 41-12. Bluefield, 0. Graham, 10. Midland Trail, 28-7. Oak Hill gets the win. Summers County gets the win over Pikeview. Roan gives Shady a 41-12 win. West Side, 58. Wyoming East, 6. Pendleton gives Greenbrier West a loss. Liberty loses to Polka, and Midland Trail wins against Van. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that is it. First week of fabulous football Fridays in the books, but it's only going to get better from here. Don't go anywhere. Your final forecast, next. <laughs>